everyone and welcome to the HEB Montrose Market. In the hottest time of the year, we're with an expert that's going to show us how to grill some incredible dishes. If you don't have a grill, you can do this inside, but we're talking seafood, specifically lobster, right? That's right, Miss Tandy, Tangy. So uh, lobster, one of the most elegant, beautiful proteins that we get to work with, especially at HEB, we have the fresh caught. That's so, right. uh, and it's so hot outside, keeping your recipe short and fast, what better way to cook it? Absolutely. So we're going to be doing a few lobster tails today. Uh, the recipe is simple, classic, but effective. Uh, the ingredients speak for themselves and take it to the next level. I love it. Great. So if we're on the grill, we've got charcoals running in your pyramid style. You know, they're nice and hot. Fortunately, we've been blessed with a gas grill here at HEB. And these are going to go cut side down first. For how long? These literally take 10 minutes total time, so I would say about five minutes each side. And flip those over, you guys see that beautiful bright red. The meat's done cooked on one side, gonna cook for a few minutes on the other. That'll be ready in just a couple of minutes. Okay, and going back to our butter mixture here, we've got the European style butter, fresh mm -hmm. chopped chives, the roasted garlic for a little bit of crunch, and the black pepper. Just spoon it on there and uh, don't be shy. And we're serving the finished lobster tail, beautiful red color, over a bed of Israeli couscous. It's the new rice for me. It's beautifully shaped, healthy grain. You flavor it up like any starch. Uh, that is amazing. And that truffle salt is just that hint of decadence. Absolutely. All good. All right, we're there's good. more deliciousness. And we're, this time we're doing a fun shrimp dish. The yes, key is the ingredient, right? That's right. It's the Napa Jack's Chardonnay and Roasted Garlic Marinade. Uh, we've got a few peeled and deveined shrimp, again, from the uh, seafood case. They're ready to go. They're thawed. They're deveined. Couldn't be easier for you. A couple of swivels on the Spanish oil. You're going to see those bubbles in the oil. That means it's hot enough. Great key right. indicator. And uh, we'll go ahead and pop these babies in there. Now, you don't want to overcrowd the skillet, so we're just going to lay them flat and uh, evenly spaced. There we go. And I like to give them individual attentions. Okay, so these have been searing for about a good minute, minute and a half. Let's go ahead and start flipping over. Ah, look at that beautiful, beautiful. color. Beautiful. So the Parmesan and the dill are going to brown lovely just on the other side. Look at that. All right, so a minute later, you're going to take that uh, Chardonnay roasted garlic in the skillet it goes. <laughs> Be careful if you have a lot of hairspray because I have a lot. <laughs> So that's all it takes. Let it get hot for a couple of minutes. Beautiful flavor. Right over here, if you guys take a look. Um, my favorite pasta. I don't know why. It's the shape, it's the size, it's the delicacy of it. So we're topping our shrimp, we're putting our shrimp over a bed of angel hair pasta. Love the nests that come pre-portioned. They're serving friendly. Got a certain amount of people coming over. You don't want to cook too much pasta. Uh, three minutes in some boiling water is all it takes. Thank you okay, very much. I have a new favorite product. <laughs> Napa Jack Chardonnay and Roasted Garlic. That's it. And oh. you know what? I have it in Cabernet too, so if you're more of a red wine, steak kind of person. And you had a wine pairing right quick? We did. Okay, if you've never been in Napa Valley, you've got to get down there. Love the Artisa Estate Chardonnay. It's going to be clean, crisp, a little bit oaky. Pairs mm. perfectly with I like that your shrimp too. and lobster. All right. Chef, thank, thank you. Thank you so much. It was Yum. a privilege having you in my kitchen. Dinner's on. Yeah. The other chefs are going to be jealous. <laughs>